Hi everybody. So today again, we are going to have this maths meditation that I always tell you that I do. And uh, please uh, look at the screen and see what meditation, why I call this as a meditation. If you uh, can focus for your focus to happen, I'm switching off the video and let us get going with with the with the thing that we are to be doing. So here is what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to do if you see the questions that I have. The question number 162 says name other if purchased which cost more than 2500 so it is a name so if it is not there then uh, i i can just replace it with and remove the nose and replace it with home equipment so here is what i am doing i have i am filtering the entire uh, sheet right now and uh, look at this the home equipments are there and in case of yes i have just put them as home equipment and if you see uh, how many installment it took because if i remove this one uh, to this guy you can see that it has to be amount of loan taken and other things. So there is this one, yes, no is not required. If it is amount invested in the purchase from savings, then there is no reason why there should be an instrument for repayment because you haven't taken any loan. Now, number of the items purchased. It cannot be 6,000, so uh, naturally the figure is wrong here. So what I have done is, I'm validating this, right? So uh, home equipment, if you if we go, the other things are, so it is just one. So in case of up to 40,000, it is just one. So let me safely put 1,000. Any home equipment, like bed and other things will be so in case of will be around forty thousand right so in case of no I have put zero and because there is no loan taken so in, even if it is yes I have put no now here there is a loan taken for thousand it is it is I think the amount is switched over so I'll put this as so it will be kind of 24 and here it is 1300 from savings and loan will be of 13,000 and this also is 24 installment because in microfinance the installments are usually 12 or 24 so that is why I am putting these numbers so it is just out of practice that uh, uh, of, of, about the realities as well, which is why I am doing this. Now there is no loans taken, so it will be zero. And here also I can put 24. And again, this is zero and this is 15,000 and I'll be put. And we put it ready. Now this is done for home equipment. What else is there? Let me see if there is something else. So it, this is done. This segment is done. Now if you look at the filter thing, it is already gone. If there is something called no, and there is also zero, let us see what is this zero and no is all about. So here I can put no and all others can be zero. 
So I'll be just copying it, replacing the zeros with no. There is no already, so just replacing them. And there is a 50,000 as well. Let me keep that uh, 50,000. And because somebody has mistakenly might have put that 50,000, so I'll utilize that 50,000. Somebody has put, has taken a loan to buy some home furniture or something. We don't. So all the zeros now are becoming no. There are a lot of zeros because not, not many people spend for home equipment randomly unless it is very much required. So obviously there are many no's out here. Let me complete it. There are 1651 records out here. So all of them will become no. everything has become no and I'll save this. See. Now do you find this kind of spreadsheets in your daily work? If you are from a development sector, you might be working with such kind of uh, let me put uh, target thing, target segment and you might be tracking their, their uh, development as well. So this one is what I told you, still there is a zero somewhere. So let me see where I uh, we left a zero. Did you see that when you were putting C, so many zeros are still there. So I'll copy again and take this and make it low. So now if you filter it, the zero is gone. Only no is there. Since we have sorted out the no, let me and other equipments are okay, fine. But let us also, home equipment we did, smartphone and sofa. Let us see if they are okay. See? Smartphone 25, it is not possible, right? So, what I can do is do and out of saving, I'll put 7000 just to utilize this data. So, that is done. Smartphone and this one is done. Let us go for 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. This should not come in the name. So that is why I am taking them out what are those. So if you can see here, this should have come in the second the so let me take into the next step. And the all others things are 1, 2, 3, 4. Those are not relevant, so I'll put them as no and 0, 0, 0, 0 and 0. What I have done is I have taken those 
and put out here. And since there are these loan amounts are there, I put them as 24, 24, and 24. Right? And uh, this will be something that is for it as smartphone. It can be any equipment, but we have to take this smartphone because, uh, you know, uh, it is around 15,000. Let us see if smartphones are similar or not. Smartphone is good. Now, all other things are no. Let us put them as no, as well, because there is no data. Since there is no data, I am just removing, validating them like this. Uh, before going there, let me put this as uh, home equipment only. Because we are not very sure what are this. Right, all other data are zero, so one, two, three, four doesn't matter out. So this this thing, if you select all, then these four groups are sorted, right? Um, here, let us take another time. If it is okay or not. There are 1651. So why mid-seniors need to take this? You have to always put such kind of matrices. You know? This is uh, what we are trying to create a product design for, a, um, for an emergency health product. Suddenly somebody falls sick and requires urgently 10,000 or 20,000 rupees. Microfinance will not go and pay this. Now what do we do? Uh, we are creating a health loan kind of thing where we are assessing the paying capacity of the borrower, right? Uh, for this, we are assessing the entire uh, entire purchase pattern of those uh, people and. Uh, so that we can document. If these are the criteria, then we can very well give them a loop with some kind of um, detailing that we need to do. Here, there is one. This can be zero. This can be zero. This is one, one, three, two, zero. See, some zeros have been still left up. So, always check about if you have left out some data. Here, here, all the zeros need to be done. That is a zero as well. Have we taken care of everything? Yes. So, now, question number 162 to 166 is done. Did you see the significance of what I did? So if you have learned anything out of from here, then this will be second secret that I do, how to achieve significance. So, Apply this kind of creating a database is very essential. And please do this to achieve significance because everybody in development sector requests track tracking of whatever they have done because it is a very long process. So, uh, so, so that is why you need to track so that you know and 
keep motivating yourself that being such dream. So if you like this, if you are watching this in Facebook, then please like the video. And if you are watching it in YouTube, then please like and comment below the video. And uh, yes. And if you want to speak to me about how to do your uh, exercise, this kind of tracking format, then we can speak. Thank you for watching.